Hey, would you look at that? We're playing a Sega game that isn't Sonic for a change. I love that hey, Sega logo nice. in this game, by the way. Like, that one in particular. In a far-off galaxy, an evil alien force is at work as an accountant at U.S. An, Bank. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Joke ceiling whore. Joke's on you. I was thinking about that when I was recording the footage for this game. The evil tyrant Greedy has corrupted the planet's leaders and made these guys very scared <laughs> and enslaved the populace. Even the legendary hero has been captured. A desperate plea for help is called... I wonder what that star is going to turn brain? into. Uh, this is the galaxy carry. Oh, the galaxy yeah, is right. a giant brain. Yeah. And this guy's just snapping. He's just fucking PDX knocked. Is that a star underwater? Is a bubble. And answered by the hero's own son. All right, so this is this is Ristar, known in uh, Japan as Ristar the Shooting Star. Yes, sir. Okay, I don't know why they cut why out the. Why was he underwater? I don't know why oh. they cut out the Shooting Star subtitle there. It's kind of weird, actually, but. Anyway, this game, uh, as you can tell by the uh, super psychedelic aesthetic going on here, was actually created by Sonic Team. Mm -hmm. I mean, also a great game to play when you're on an acid trip, probably. <laughs> this looks just like a, yeah, this looks just like a Sonic game. You, you get that vibe? 100%. Um, like, I could just, except for half the speed, because he's not, you know, Yeah, he's Star. not very fast. Ristar's not very fast. Um, you think he's a shooting star? You'd think he'd be even... even Faster than Sonic. Yeah, um... Actually, facts. Well, he oh, flies fast, sometimes. Dude. Uh, anyway, um... But only sometimes. Yeah, this game... Actually, technically, they weren't Sonic Team yet. Like, back in the oh. early 90s, Sonic Team was just the name of the team that worked on Sonic 1. Uh, but Sonic Team as, like, an actual studio was not formed until, uh, 1995. The year this game came out, but their first title, like, under the Sonic Team name being, uh, Nights into Dreams. Yes, sir. Uh, and that, I mean, that's a game for another time. Um, anyway, so this game is, um, this game is, uh, yeah, you use your hands to grab things and bash your head into enemies, and so that's pretty uh. neat. Uh, and. fun fact, though, uh, the main character, Ristar, his sprites were edited in the North American version to make him look angry. <laughs> I mean, you know, it's, uh... It's the Kirby syndrome. It's Kirby oh, what's syndrome, this, what's all right. This, what's Kirby this cute syndrome, character? Yes. What's this cute character here? Oh, he looks really cute and personable, and I bet a lot of girls would like him. Fucking anger. He hates everything. He <laughs> wants him to be dead a thousand times over. He to be tough in America. You see, the funny thing is, like, it's really only his idol sprite that looks pissed, though. <laughs> yeah. Because, like, like, they didn't bother to change all of a sudden everything. He's... He's mad that he's slamming his face into the wall trying to climb up, and he's like, yeah, I'm having a great day. And he's saying, so I was like, fucking stupid fucking plants. I think even even when he's, he's walking, it's star. like his eyebrows actually lift a bit, so he still looks kind of like just casual and whatever. Yeah. But yeah, uh, he's yeah, uh, in the in the Japanese version, he's smiling the whole time. Oh, well, you know. <laughs> I'm pretty it's... sure they just flipped the sprite of the mouth upside down. <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh. Uh, it's like, national damn, bro, why is, why is it's like damn, bro? Why is the tongue in the roof of your mouth? Because Sonic was hardcore. This guy needs to be hardcore too. <laughs> Yeah, Sonic was a was a was a dude with attitude. This guy needs to be a star who goes to the bar. I don't know. That's weird. Dodge. Well, and the thing I, is, I like a... the thing is, like, well, Sonic was always per per like uh, portrayed as like cool. It's like the whole dude with attitude thing was very specifically an American Sonic thing. Yeah. Yeah. What was Sonic's character like in Japan then? Uh, like in Sonic OVA. I mean, yeah. I mean, yeah. Yeah. I mean, pretty cocky and relaxed. He, he was cocky and relaxed, but he wasn't like, oh, yeah, I got a speed keyed way past cool, like the American Very counterpart. Yeah. Like, like you've seen the OVA, Carrie. Um, he's like Everything's that. over the top in America. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Well, especially yeah. in the 90s. Include, including our debt. That's just crazy over the top. Okay, well, that, that was that was bet that was less over the top in the 90s. Yeah. Uh, very much so. so. So I don't think Ristar is actually a star, oh, because well, he's a thoughts. shooting star, which is actually a comet. And so he's really sad uh, that he's not a star, so he has to wear Ristar his, his star costume, because 
All he wants to be when he grows up is a star, and so he's dressing up as one so he doesn't have to face the Whoa. sad fact that he'll never actually be a real star in his this life. Was not, this was not the carry lore I was expecting. I was expecting you to say he's not a star because he's not, like, made of gas and um, destroying everything just by coming into contact with it. <laughs> well, that's the truth. That was one of my clues that he's not actually a star was because he's walking. And he's, uh, you know, just just chilling, and everything else is just chilling around him. Whereas well, he's an actual thing, star, I mean, nothing not gonna, would be chill. He's not gonna face the reality of not being a star because he had to face that giant snake and fucking killed it too. Though. <laughs> to stalk him, kill him. Literally, to stalk him, kill him. Oh, yeah. speaking he's of embarrassed that he's just a chunk of rock, so he has to wear this mask all the time in order to boost his confidence. Oh, it's just a mask. Yeah, it's it's not at that. It's just so what a, you're yeah, telling not me actually is, a star. So what you're telling me, wrist star is Jim Carrey. It's just his star costume. Yes. Wait, 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 wait. But if Riz stars Jim Carrey, doesn't that mean he's Dr. Eggman? <laughs> yeah, that's why this is like a Sonic game. Oh! <laughs> yeah, because just like Dr. Eggman's not really an egg, Riz stars not really a star. Anyway, yeah, exactly. much like... Exactly. Look, Carrey put two and two together. Much like, mm -hmm. um, much like Sonic games, uh, in Ristar, uh, stages are split into two levels, um, and, like, with the, uh, second one having a different background and different music and some new gimmicks. Much like, much like in Sonic 3. You know, I really like that about Sonic games, and I guess, uh, consequently, about this game too. I think it adds some a lot of interest to the stages. Yeah, it wasn't really it wasn't really a thing until Sonic Three, um, and Sonic mm -hmm. Mania does it as well. Although, although uh, Sonic CD uh, did something different by having its time travel mechanic, which was That's a very future. similar thing, but ultimate, but you know, functionally different. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Future. Future. That's my man, uh, Squid Dillard. Oh, man, bro. That guy, Do you think Squidward's gonna that, be high tier? He, he bashed that tree so hard that it fell. Just with his head. You know, when I was a kid, I ran into uh, a car once so hard that it fucking detonated. It was crazy. <laughs> the the owner came out. The owner came outside sh from shopping and he was like, What the fuck? And then I, and he, because he saw his car was up in flames and he just saw me and I was perfectly fine. And he's like, Did you see anything? And I was like, No. <laughs> <laughs> Even though I knew, I knew, I knew. Right, so did the security, and so did the, and so did the, uh, and so did the security guard who saw him. That's why I got 20 years in prison. Oh. As a child. Oh. I'm fine though. Wait a second, I wait a second, to... wait a second. But you're 21, does that mean that this happened when you were a baby? <laughs> no, 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 I got, I, 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 I got out, I got out early on good behavior. How early? Oh. Three years. <laughs> I thought you I was, had the superpower six... of time dilation. No, I and did, that you could but serve 20 I years I of prison in like 30 seconds. But the thing is, I didn't know I had it at that time. I was still just a fucking Ram 1500 in the form of a human child. All right, so that, so, that yeah. Silver Star item you just saw, that's a big deal because it actually refills your health entirely while um, the gold ones just give you nice. one piece of health. That's what the stars in the corner are. They're your health. One piece of HP? Yeah, but... Oh, it's nice. HP. Yeah, but Gabe, now that you're older, if you ever have to serve 20 years in prison again, you can utilize your t your powers of time dilation, serve your 20 years, and then just wake up 30 seconds later. Yeah. Like nothing happened. But the thing is that 20 years will have passed. So I will be like, you know, Carrie, you'll be like, you'll be a, a pile of dust. I don't know why. <laughs> don't, uh, you'll be a sentient pile of dust. Evan will be six foot eight. Wait, um, what? No, 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 no uh, the opposite direction. It'll be like nothing happened on our side, but you will have experienced 20 years on our Ah, second. true. I'll just have experienced 20 years of sleep. And they'll be like, hey, Gabe, how was your weekend? I was like, I don't know, I was asleep. I don't know, I was pretty tired, man. Why don't you just, <laughs> just like, you, know, you, you could also achieve that by going into a coma. Yeah, but see, then I'd actually have Boss to wait Arena. out that time. Riho is coming. <laughs> I misread that you know, as well, there's I know. this theory that because Jesus in Christianity is God, that during the three days he was dead after crucifixion, he experienced all of the suffering of humanity that, or all that humanity needed to suffer in hell, but like eternity in three days, and then because so then he's why God, did he Jesus was... go to hell if he's like a good boy? It's probably a really deep answer to that that super smart theologians have answered, oh, shit, but I am not super smart, nor am I a theologian. That... I can't answer that. This octopus dude just latches onto this guy and makes him evil. And <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. I fucking hate when I'm you know, going deep sea diving and a ten uh, it's a tentacle from a weird octopus just touches me, and all of a sudden I start drowning my diving instructor. So, so when it said that he corrupted the world's leaders, he meant like literally, not like through some sort of like um, bribery. Political. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or political or horse trading. Or yeah. Like that. 
And I yeah. don't mean actual trading of horses, I mean the political type of horse trade. The metaphorical type. That involves something. I didn't pay attention in US history. Anyway, I do wanna I, mean I do government. wanna talk uh, real quick about like Oh, he's happy, he's free, he put his hands in the air and then he left. <sighs> and he's made it. Alright, you ready so... you ready to see some real shooting star action? Yeah. Is this like one of those Kirby end stage things? <sighs> yeah, I mean that's essentially the goal game. Yeah. You just fucking rocket it up. Yeah, you get a bonus for how high you exit the stage in a non-boss level. In um, see, Is he's that. He's a shooting huh. star. He looks like something. Wonderful. He, he looks, looks like a shooting like star. Like something I've seen before in a video game. He looks game. like. He looks like if I throw a rock and somebody intercepts it with a piece of cheese and the piece of cheese is like just kind of stuck to the front of the rock. But because the rock is heavier, the rock is still traveling yes. faster. Carrie, I think exactly I know, I think I, about. I think I know what you're familiar with, okay? Oh, 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 bring it. One time you watched me play this. So I've actually seen it before. Yeah, I think I only showed you the first level, which this whole part consists of, but still. Yeah. All right, anyway, next time on Smash Team okay. Games, uh, the star shoots itself to a different planet, except no, it just happened now. The star that's okay. not actually a star. Yeah.